This, I believe, is a 1940s. It's a Montgomery Wards airline charger, 6 volts DC. And it's, it's a battery charger, pretty much. It's a small generator. Right here, this is the carburetor. Get your mixture right here. Choke just by turning this outside knob. Spark is controlled off the ignition coil right here. And as you can see down here, my cutout doesn't look so healthy anymore. The starter switch I replaced. It's supposed to be a push button, I got a push pull switch. So what I did to fix the cutout is I just put another one on the other side here because I didn't have one that would fit the holes for the screws properly. So I just made it myself. Just off the mounts that are holding the gas tank down. There's wires running underneath as they originally would have been. It's wired up like it should be. This engine here I believe only has a half crank so you pop this open and you can see inside the entire crankcase. It has compression. And then right here, I think, yeah, this one here is positive. This one here is negative, and that's where you attach the, the wires to. And I think you can start it by either pulling this while it's attached to a battery. Now this is broken right here, but it will still work. You spin this rope starter cup here, I built it up to another engine. Someday I hope to get it running. Right now it doesn't run though. I can't even get spark yet. I'm not sure if I have to have it hooked up to a battery or not.